Hello there. Welcome to Reading Journey. This is Chief Empress Healing Flower, aka Journey. You can just call me Journey. Welcome. So I've got a few things that I, at least two things I want to chat with you about. Um, has something to do with your growth. That it looks really, really good. Um, but let's go ahead and get started. First, I want to say thank you to my creators, my mama, my papa, creators of everything. Um, I'd like to also, let's go, also acknowledge my ancestors and guides, saying thank you to them, because all of these um, beings and supreme beings helped me on my journey and helped me to give messages to you. Let's go ahead and get grounded as well. And then I'll get you those messages. We just get prepped to receive, okay? Just nice deep breaths in and out. You're going to close your eyes. Let your shoulders drop so that uh, we can get good messages. And let's go ahead and block all this unnecessary energy while I'm chatting with you. So, so chat and a message at the same time. So you're definitely, um, you've grown quite a bit and you're not who you were before. And there, what, there was a sign, okay, whoever's going to pick up on this particular message. Bears me one second. Thank you, angels. Um, you're a powerful being. I just heard that. Um, but a new you has come aboard. Um, and you could have felt this within the, the past few months. Um, my daughter and I, we were talking about this yesterday. And I remember saying... Some months back, I was like, and I remember looking in the mirror and I stood there for a second. I was like, wait, this, this is somebody else. But in a good way, I was like looking at myself and I was like staring, trying to stare at even in my eyes to look at through my eyes. If I could possibly do that, because I knew this, this new person had emerged. There's a reason I'm telling you this. Hold on. Okay. So whoever I'm talking to, a new person, like you're like, I can't explain it, but I seem different. Like I'm not the person I was. And then after that, you there was a memo that you received either from spirit, either from within a dream or from somebody. Someone may have said it to you that you're so-and-so, you're this, you remind me of this. Wow, you're a queen or wow, you're an empress, or wow, you're a, you know, somebody could have said that, or it could have just been a feeling, and you gracefully stepped into that new you. Now, as you're going through this process, there's energies being projected your way, um, not just from in the physical people around you, um, not just, um, some of it may have been like, they didn't even know they were doing it, the spirit in which they were carrying or whatever negative spirit that they're carrying. But it's also from a higher scale as well, from these higher governments. Um, my chosen ones, you're getting fought with those as well because you, yeah, I'm like, you are a target. Like, that's what I'm hearing clearly. Like, the enemy knows exactly who you are and what you are. And although you might think it's on a very small scale, like, oh, I'm not that important, I can't affect, you affect 
a wide, yeah, because now they're showing me a wide range. Like if you're in a city, you're in a city and your energy, your light goes all in that city. <clears throat> in other words, what you say so in that city, what you speak, this, I, this is how powerful I have that our, now I know all, everybody is not this. You'll know whether you're not, whether this is you or not. But your say so in that city, your words can change what happens, what takes place, what stops in that city. It's 5.33 o'clock. I'm not playing. And I ain't got time to tell you some flamboyant stuff or not flamboyant, but some, I don't, I can't think of the word for it, but something to just make you feel good and be like, oh my gosh, yes, I'm so this and I am and impressive person i'm impressive being in the city and i can change the way cities move and this witchcraft i can take it down and that's not what this is about and i know whoever i'm talking to you know that and you don't care but literally what you say in that city that's why you're there i've got some that are in a city and they don't want to be in that city. They hate the place, right? But planted there because of the wickedness that's being done there. Now, I'm not saying you're the savior, Mr. and Mrs. Savior. That's not it. Your job is to, excuse me, speak a word. Yeah, see, and I went and got this right in the middle of your reading. And I started digging. So it's like you are finding the hidden, the deep crevices without even looking. You, cause you're a seer, you're seeing things and you see things that are deep and hidden. And yeah, 655, you bring balance and change. You're there, you, listen, sweetheart, you don't know how important, and maybe you do. Maybe you're starting to have a, 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 an awakening to this. How important you are. That's why you've been going through the hell that you've had to go through. That's why. That's one of the reasons. There's many other reasons. You've been placed in places that you're like, I don't fit here anymore. I don't want to be here. Hell, I should have came here in the first place. Excuse me. But that's why. Now, the other thing. You're getting ready to move. You're leaving. You're getting ready to take flight. Um, and the way I feel it is, and I saw it in a dream last night, you're not telling anybody that you're doing it. You can't, um, in your situation, you cannot. Yours is more so, I'll tell you when I get there, if I tell you at all. Um, because there's a new you that has everything starting to line up. Remember I said months ago, you looked different. You felt different. You're like, something's different about me. Then a few months later, I'm taking on this person. I, this, 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 uh, call or, um, whatever it is. I, I don't have a word for it, but I accept it. Right. I accept it. I am now, I accept who I am. I accept that I have gifts. I accept that I have responsibilities. I accept that I'm not going to fit in and I wasn't supposed to um, with everybody. I have a tribe and I have, you know, I'm okay with that. And my tribe is trickling in and that's okay. But you're getting ready to, yeah, live, live leave to live your dream life. It's all coming together. You may not be able to, you can't see. No, nope, you can't see the picture of how, what this is going to look like. Also heard surprise. You're not going to know what this is going to look like. I can get, but you know what though? I feel like people may sense it. There may be someone or some ones that know something that's going on that you don't know yet. But you're going to be more, you're going to be happy. You're going to definitely be in your best health you've ever been. But 
many of the steers that will watch, like yourself, your health is better, you're eating better, you're feeling better. Um, that negative energy has dropped off. Um, even if there's some being still trying to be projected, uh, you're really protected and you really know how to protect yourself. I feel that the, uh, the truth is, yeah, they're saying that to me. The truth is your vibration is so high because you start, you've accepted the call. You know who you are. You have a, you're, you're better than you were before. You're better than you were before. And that's just the truth of it. So let's take a look here. This is a beautiful, 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 beautiful. Yeah, I think I want it. Let me, hold on one second. If I have another deck to mine here. Better than you were before, sweetheart. Really are. Yeah. 24, 24 is looking me in the face. What is that? 66? Yep. Yeah, another six for you. Again, I said, you're going off to your dream life. You don't even know, though. I feel like this, man, I can feel that. There's people that know you're about to have a dream life. You probably don't even see it yet. You're just trusting. You have faith in that, right? You're not um, scorned by anyone. I'm getting that. Some... So you're not scorned by anyone. You're not uh, focused on something that may have been done to you or taken away. You just know that you trust that the universe, the earth, the trees, the birds, everything, your angels, your guys, everything is just lining up. And there's something about water. I don't know if you're Someone's going somewhere near water. You're going to be to a place near water. Maybe that's what you've been desiring, to be close to water. Yeah. Good times. Good times ahead. You'll be able to rest. Someone's been working a lot in the physical and the spiritual. Somebody's really been giving off. A lot of, especially if you're a healer or you're doing any type of um, healing work or anything that involves helping others, you've been giving off a lot of energy. It is time for you to rest. I feel like you were supposed to rest some time ago, but there was some interference at that time, but you had things still to learn. Hmm. Yeah. It's because of your kindness, your happiness, your love, your affection. The chances that you took. Your faith, I'm hearing. Your trust in the universe. Something wants to come in and say, apologize. Don't know who or what that is. I don't feel like it's somebody you want, though. Yeah, justice and judgment. So I guess the person that I just saw is about to receive some type of, uh, looks like the universe is going to be dealing with them, the most high. That's why I didn't feel, I didn't feel compelled to even look at that card because I feel like that's somebody that you don't even want to look at. Like I'm so done or it's an energy, right? It could be a people taking on one energy that you're just not interested in anymore, that you're just not even because I feel like some of these are family members. Some of you is your own mother or father. Yeah, your own kin or her. Just did a lot. And it's too bad because this new journey, this good time journey you're going on, it can't go on. Maybe it keeps trying to pop up. <laughs> and you're like, and I'm just like, no, good. So I'm sure that's how you're feeling. You're like, no, nah, not interested. Not, not interested. I feel like your focus is where you want to go, where you have to go, and that's it. Nothing to detour you. And the good and the thing about it is you're better than you ever were before, Sierra. Ever were before. Like this is like 
and like I'm a I'm back energy. Something is gonna come back if it hasn't already. Where you've said yes, I'm back, and I'm better, right? And this is what I'm getting. Someone was afraid of. Someone was afraid of that. That you were going to get to that point. That you were going to meet your goal. Because they knew. So this is somebody who knew energetic paths. This is someone who knew that you have some type of gift. Or there's something that you are about. That you're going to obtain. That they didn't want you to obtain because you would have done it without them. It has something to do with money and saving. That you'll have money to save. And they didn't want you to have that. They didn't want you to have the beautiful life. Not without them. It's weird. I don't like the energy though because it's very weird. It feels awkward. It's like the energy feels to me like it was. it's dead and gone. But somebody keeps conjuring. Notice I'm using the word conjuring felt that someone keeps conjuring the energy up to keep it afloat but it's not serving them because it's not affecting you in any way because again your vibration is so high that there's no way that that's going to affect you you've already met i'm here clearly you met your goal you met your goal so Somebody can't see you anymore. If somebody was trying to track you down energetically, they can't see you. Very frustrated about that. Yeah. Very frustrated. I heard the word dying. They could, is this person passing on or something? Is this person dying inside? This person could have some type of mental issues or something going on. Or they're going mental because this cycle has complete. Yeah, this cycle has completed. Yeah. Well. Yeah. I'm definitely getting because they don't want to grow. It's. They didn't want to. Yeah, they didn't want to grow. I want to grow. 44 on the clock at the same time. Yeah, somebody's getting it. Somebody's getting it. I don't like to pry into other people's energy. If it comes up in yours, I'll do that. I stay away from that. Because um, that's just, you don't want to be pulling in those energies. Even if you feel like you're going to clear it. Some if it's none of your business, then you stay out of it. You know what I mean? If it comes up though, because sometimes, yeah, I'm hearing rules of engagement. It's just you don't want to keep pulling that up because that will also not only keep you stuck but bring in some things you don't need. And right now you're too high vibrational for that. So let's see what comes out. What's going on with them? Anything that's in their energy that anyone's trying to do around them. So I'm just going to try to go around that. Look at that. Four wands. Harmony. Peace. Get this here. It's because, yeah, it's because you worked hard. I heard also hard work ahead. So you've got some work coming up, some, some some new stuff coming up. Yeah, a new future. You're moving, somebody's for for real, moving, moving. Like, I don't give a, this energy I feel like, I don't give a damn, I'm leaving. Like, I don't care if I get help or not. <laughs> I don't give a damn. I'm going to leave. Ooh, 10 of pentacles. Hmm. Yeah, you're going towards your dreams. You're like, I don't care. I'm going whether I don't know how. It's like you somebody's just really stepping on on faith. Like really like I'm going after what's mine. I know it's out there and I know it's coming. I'm going to continue to call it in. 
I also heard warrior. Somebody's a warrior in the spiritual realm. You're 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 it. I also could be dealing with some. You could be taking on Aries energy, very fiery. Sag or Leo, you could be one of those signs as well. But you're headed, you're going, you're chasing what you want. You're like, and somebody's like, I know what's mine is out there. And I'm going to receive what's mine. Beautiful. And you are. You are. When you, yeah, because I'm telling you, the earth, the universe is going to match the vibration that you're at. And whatever you're doing, you're already seeing some results. Whether it's like, maybe you just started a business and it's really taking off. Or um, maybe you started, you know, started uh, working on changing your diet and you're losing weight. Like you're truly like, yes, things are back in sync, back in flow. Um, or you just feel lighter. Like, yep, I don't feel that heaviness of that energy that has been projected to me in the past. Um, or you're having like more, you're having clearer, uh, you're better sleep, clear sleep, peaceful. Even the environment, 21, 21 o'clock feels more peaceful around you. And you could even, I'm not going to go there, but Yeah. I'll say for my um, people who are very spiritually inclined and you understand um, how magic and spirits work now, you could maybe even sense that someone's trying to invade the space, but they can't. They can't. All they can sit there and do is watch, right? So you just continue to keep your space clean, yourself clean and grounded and waiting. You're waiting. You're going for it. And you're not actually... You're waiting without, you waiting, but you're not waiting because you're going forward. You already, you're planning. You have wand in hand. So you're like, okay, I know my direction. I'm setting a path here. And you're just kind of like universe meet me. If it's something that, two, yeah, two, 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 two on the clock. Um, universe, meet me where you need to meet me, but this is where I'm going. If you need to tweak it and you can make it better, I will take that. I'm open to that as well, but I'm chasing after what I have to go after. I'm calling in what I need. I'm calling in. I know something out there is mine and I'm calling it in. I know there's somewhere else I belong and I'm going. I'm putting this to an end. Whatever is going on, anybody trying to block anything, do anything, I'm putting it to an end, period. And you have them here, and clearly you have the authority to do so. No one has the authority to just walk and waltz and do whatever they think, uh, whatever the hell they want. Just walk into your Kashic Records, come into your life and do all kinds of bullshit. They don't have the authority to do that. But until you, this also, this is what I was getting this, this uh, AM as well, was... You are better now, right? You had to go through a space of confusion and it was years. 33 and o'clock. Yeah, for you to master something, you had to have, you had to be pulled away or stripped away from the old you, the old things that you were doing, your old time religion or whatever it was in order for you to become who you are now, which is very powerful. You already, did, yes, I remember last night. Okay, because I remember talking to the Most High. You always were, like say you are an emperor or empress and you get that now. You're not running around and yelling the title or anything like that, right? I have many of you, many who will watch who are emperors and empresses like yourself, right? You now, um, you always were that 24, 24 on the clock. Since you were a baby, you were already, it was already set designed in your DNA. It was already there. Just like when somebody is trying to take something from you, like we're going to take this, this, these riches, this wealth from this, blah, 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 this gifts or whatever they were trying to take. It's in your DNA. It's written in the stars, your DNA everywhere, everywhere. You think I'm joking? This might, listen, those who can understand and overstand with me, that shit was written in a tree already. 
Like, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? It's written everywhere. It's written everywhere. It's written in these. Hold on, baby. It's written in these. They look kind of dead, but it's all right. Don't, don't worry about that. It's written in these flowers. You better, you better hear me. You better understand and understand what I'm talking about, baby. The most high is clearly saying it's written. It's everywhere. All life forms, I'm hearing it. It's written. You can't change that. That's where they fucked up. You can't change that. 33 other clock. You know why it's written? Does anybody understand? Or I should say understand or overstand? Because it's a big one. This is a big one. It's because you are God. I said it. Yeah, you. You are God. You are the most high. The most high is in you. Nobody can take that away. Nobody can take that away. They can fight all day. It's like in my mind's eye, they're showing me the devil just trying to fight. But you can't. What are you going to do? Tear every tree down? You don't hear me. You don't hear me. Somebody listen, listen, listen. If you hear me, put an ashe in that comments. It's written everywhere. Everywhere. Mm, that's powerful. Thank you, Most High. Everywhere. But do you hear me though? Somebody or this energy, how many people are dealing with you? Has figured that out. Now they're trapped. I'm hearing clearly I made a mistake. Mm -hmm. You can change that ever. All this was swear was most I was just waiting for you to understand for you to understand and understand and catch up. Nothing was ever gonna happen to you, really. Sure. If these people or person was doing energy energy energetically and they've taken out some other souls before or whatever, that's fine. Beings, other beings. But guess what? Everybody is not human. Everybody is not immortal. Everybody is not a god or goddess. You feel me? They were never gonna, nothing was gonna happen to you. Everybody doesn't have a soul. There are soulless beings. There are NPCs out there. They are. Got a lot. You got a lot going on out in this world. You got creatures. You got demons. You got soulless beings. You got um, all types of things. Things that you and I can't even see. You got things coming through portals. We got portals all over this earth. They just keep them locked down. But there's coming a day. Where they won't be locked down forever. Look at how many times we're gonna get this. Help me. That's kind of what I get with this. Help me. I was careless. I was careless. But what's the same thing they served you is being served back to them. Because all they offered you was entrapment. This is this is this is coming up back to them because this is what was done to you. And what they want you to do, and yeah, they want you to do the opposite. They want you to offer them forgiveness and get them out of a trap while the whole time this is what you offered me. Entrapment? Really? That's what y'all offering? 
But now you want me to rescue you? Oh gosh, I just heard that clearly. Somebody said it. Either a guide or y'all said it. Go to hell. <laughs> Why did I just pull this out? And I pulled it out reverse. Hold on. Yeah, somebody doesn't want to. They were greedy. Someone wants to come out of their shadow self. They want to come out of entrapment. Someone bound themselves to that, though. Yeah, because they thought that was going to be wish fulfillment. Could have been an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius doesn't have to just be that. Could be anywhere in their chart because if they're, they were an ex of yours, ex male could be in their Mars, ex female, Venus, could be your mother, baby mother. I'm hearing all kinds of stuff. I'm telling you, somebody wants, please, 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 please. Oh, please. That's what I'm getting. I felt that yesterday too when I was uh I was in the kitchen loading my dishwasher and I felt somebody go, please, please, please. No, no, no. Cause you thought this was you thought somebody yeah, I'm here clearly. My guys are telling me they thought it was funny, thought it was hilarious watching you suffer. Yeah, I'm here. They ought to be ashamed of themselves. They're having a tower moment. They're losing everything. Everything that they gain in a negative, dark way is crumbling. It's all being taken away. Okay, now I see why. Thank you, sweet spirit. That's why every, that card is reversed. Everything. Everything. I mean everything. And now you have a queen of pentacles who's a total biatch. Who's still acting crazy. Who's also losing finances. And she is ripped mad about it. Who now wants to try to make you some fake false offer to work with you. Child ain't got nothing to work with. What? But wants to convince you that they do. I, I'm not even going to waste my time on this. Because I'm showing. I don't even want to. Listen. They're fake. And then there's a queen of cups also who's watching. There's somebody's mom. Somebody's mother here is involved as well. Who's been working also, I feel like, with this energy. May not even know the person just working with this energy. So understand or overstand with me. This energy can travel lots of places into many people, into different states, countries. Nah, usually... Yeah, they're telling me. Yeah, all jurisdictions, they can't. But they can travel far. It's an energy. 33 on the clock. So these two people may be at a distance. You may not even know these damn. Now, you may know. Maybe you don't, though. Somebody may not know one of these individuals. Yeah, it's about this. Tell me more about that Ace of Pentacles. Then I'm going to wrap it up, y'all. I don't want to keep it too long for you. I don't want you to get exhausted. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So let me tell you, there's been some juggling in the past. I definitely heard about riches. There's been some juggling in the past with lots of things. There's tangible items here. It's about a big amount of finance here. Somebody didn't want to see you receive something. Either money or worth money. It could even be a divine partner for me. Could be as well. 
who has some type of um, money or wealth. They didn't want you to get it. But the communication kept... It, it, something kept moving anyway. It skipped over them. Or it's skipping over them. Because, yeah, somebody didn't want... Someone knew you had plans to move and they didn't want you to move anywhere. But you fought that. You fought that. You're gaining victory. You fought for what's yours. And now somebody's upset or this energy is upset because somebody could be going to court or it's being brought to justice in some type of way. There's at least three people who are broken hearted about it. Could be more. But definitely it's, it's a group. That's what that's telling me. Because they all got to move out. They got to get out the way. They got to move forward. Take their bags. And I heard that clearly. Take their bags and leave. And I'm hearing that song. Bag lady. Because <laughs> these people need to heal. Or this energy or what. It's, it's more than one here. They need to heal. I hope they do what they need to do. But some of them going to wherever they bounded themselves to. So I don't know. I mean, I don't know. To tell you. But see, let's take a look, sweetheart. Let's recap. The main thing and the overall theme of all of this I even talked about is that you're about to have good times and live a life of relaxation, rest, and leisure because you put a lot of work in. You're better than you ever were before. You're going to be leaving, but you won't be, you won't be telling anybody. You'll be sneaking off. You'll either leave and you won't talk to these people ever again, or you'll leave and you'll be like, yeah, I've left and I had to leave. See you whenever I see you type of thing. I feel like most most that will watch to come across this read like you are going to be like, nope, I ain't going back. <laughs> I ain't dealing with none of y'all asses. Y'all put me through hell. I'm getting that clearly. Somebody wants to offer forgiveness. It looks like there's at least three people. And for somebody, if there's a lover that did this to you, that lover wants to as well, that ex-lover um, but there's definitely three people here. There's even a scenario where there's an energy of two women who don't know each other, who have been working with this same energy against you. I'm telling you, 44 and o'clock. This ain't even about, listen, I told you, this is, I've been trying to tell people, this is more than just you getting money. You have work to do. These are beings, I don't have to explain to you beings, but these are beings, let me talk to people who don't understand. These are beings who are were put here since childhood to raise the vibration at this, for such a time as this, to get us out of this mess, especially, I'm here, in the Mari clay? Okay, stuck in the Mari clay. Maybe you understand that. Um, especially if you're in the U.S., this whole country going through karma and the world too. These systems are being broken down. And y'all are part of that. Your words that you say, that you pray, that you put up, those things that you speak against, that you see, that others cannot see. I'm telling you, y'all like the spiritual police. I'm serious. Yeah, what's that? Speak up and speak out. Yeah, y'all the ones where... You're speaking up and speaking out against these things that you see. I'm telling you, there's a lot of folks, they, they have no idea what you're doing. Because they're sleeping. Yeah, they're telling me because they're asleep. But you are awake. There's love coming in for somebody, a divine partner coming in for someone. You're not even looking for it. You're like, I don't even give a damn. But okay, I'll take it. <laughs> I forgot what I'm getting. Yeah, you're preparing for your future. And that's what's bringing this in too, because you're like, I don't give a damn. I'm going where I need to go. And I don't need anybody's permission to do it. 
That's right. You don't because you're a God. Period. And because of that, these things are coming to you. Because of that. Somebody, yeah, somebody's recognized. I'm hearing that clearly. But they're God, they're God within. <clears throat> or God is. Breathe and let go. Anybody that may, this may be for somebody, guilt is a normal feeling. So somebody's feeling guilty. Yeah, I'm sure somebody that's done this, if you're feeling guilty, most I say, breathe and let it go. Let it go. And anybody that's feeling guilty about leaving, mm -mm, let that go. But I, most of my, I know the majority of my chosen ones, like, yeah, pfft. all right, let that go. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, be kind to yourself. Be kind to yourself. Most I want you to be kind to yourself, but where's my other? I think it's my other deck. Okay, maybe it's that one. What, what is this? Child, that's the wrong deck. That's not what I want. <laughs> Sorry. I'll just keep going with that one. That's the love deck. But yeah, and there's a big heart looking at me right in the face when I flip these over and I toss them. There's love coming. And that's probably why I tossed it the way I just did that. You're not even looking for it. You're like, whatever. I know where I got to go right now. Love is not even on the brain. Whoever this is, love is not on the brain. But you need this partner to get you to the next level. And it's not that, listen, mm-mm. Understand, you've got the skills you need. You are very skilled here, and so are they. But to get to this particular path, the most high needs y'all to do it together, okay? And there's nothing wrong with that. That's why you have male and female. You do. That's why you have masculine and feminine. He and she, the creators, the creator, the feminine aspect of the creator, she is. The God creator, she's the one who creates. She's the one that comes up with the idea. She's the one that's like, yeah, let's make this candle, right? And then the the male aspect is like, okay, I'm going to make it burn. You see what I'm saying? That's cool, right? So you got to have the two together. It's a perfect, I'm hearing it. It's a perfect mix. It's a perfect match. <clears throat> Thank you, mama. Yeah, open your heart. Keep your hearts open. Keep your hearts open. Keep that love flowing. 42, 42 in the clock. Keep that balance. Keep that love going. Which I know y'all are. I know. Um, I'm saying y'all, but I know you are. I know the seers are. But I've got some others. I've got some ops that are watching too. Who are gravitated. Who also need to heal it. All right. So this will be it. I didn't mean to go this long. I don't even know if I got that much storage. Never mind. I know I gotta. I'm working on that somehow. All right, we've got Nevada in the mix. Somehow Nevada is involved. There's an educator involved. Somebody with dreads is involved. There's a Gemini involved. Gemini could have dreads, but doesn't have to. But there's a Gemini. There's a Gemini who's also a liar and fake. California is here. We've got South Carolina here. We've got Texas here. Virginia, trust, 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 trust. Somebody in Virginia needs to trust, okay? Somebody trust what you learned from the past. Don't, um, just, yeah, leave those individuals in the past. Somebody needs to hear that. There's a Buddhist involved. An atheist is involved. Iowa's here. Maine is here. Illinois is here. S for assess middle initial. Somebody's thick involved. They could also have an S for assess middle initial who's thick. Alaska's here. Wisconsin's here. There's an arbitration taking place, especially if you're in Wisconsin. Uh, the Y for assess middle initial. You could also be going through an arbitration or will be. There's a low vibrational Capricorn. New Hampshire's here. M first last middle initial. There's an M first last middle initial who's going to prison. There's a homebody involved. There's a gamer involved. 
W for assessment initial, D for assessment initial involved, Arkansas involved, a Libra involved. There could be a Libra from Arkansas. There's a G for assessment initial involved. They could be a Libra, but they don't have to be G, G for assessment initial. Somebody singles involved. You won't be long though. I wanted to say that. Delaware is involved. Low vibrational Virgo. R for assessment initials. Somebody from Montana. Somebody from Massachusetts. <clears throat> There's a Christian involved. There could be some Christians or a Christian from Massachusetts also involved. L for assessment initial. There's a Scorpio involved. Scorpio could have an initial first, last, middle, and L, whoever that Scorpio is, but you don't have to. Either way, there's a Scorpio here, and there's a Scorpio who's highly protected by angels. There's somebody with hair weave involved. Time is ticking for somebody with a hair weave who may have done something wrong to you. Somebody curvy is involved, and somebody from Puerto Rico. And it looks like, yeah, somebody was doing something from overseas or using somebody overseas we're going to Puerto Rico overseas to do something to someone. All right. I hope you found that helpful. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. This is Chief Empress Healing Flower signing out, aka Journey. Any other information or places you want to find me, that information's in the description box below because I am on social medias as well. Take care.